Should appear. Yeah. But no, I gotta work. Hey, same. I wish I didn't have to work. Here we are. There is a lot more left in that mug than I thought. Yikes. Knock on the coffin, LTD. Yes. Aw, man. Uh, I don't know what I want to play as Bjorn. Do I, do I want to learn a new character tonight? Not really. I don't think I'm going to be playing for very long. Probably have time for one run. I'm going to do Percival. I haven't played as this guy at all. It sounds annoying. Three cards of different types in a row reduces the cost of other cards in hand by one. Playing two cards of the same type in a row increases the cost of cards in hand by one. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Morning, Regan. Yeah, a cup of tea steeping 10 minutes ago. Whoa. Whoa. Don't be money grubby guy. I like money grubby. All right. I'm going to play ads now before I start the run. Uh, a few minutes early. I will be back soon. Stick around for video game, huh? Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Uh, I'm back. I know you were all getting very impatient. <laughs> Alright. Been a minute since I played this game. I'm looking forward to it. Survive Melissa. Deadly touch. Need to sacrifice an ally to the death idol. Rotten Bog. You can drink the Might Icker. Resurrect you, but only once. Need to try not to die before meeting Milanus. Traveling merchant trades information allows one to survive Milanus' deadly touch. Never have enough money for that. So I guess we're going Rotten Bog, which is left. And there are a few question marks I haven't seen yet. So let's go down these paths, I guess. I don't think I beat the bomber. Let's try and beat the bomber. <laughs> All right, my money. Yikes. 
Bonk. Perfect. Was he expecting? Big net gain. Six damage per attack played this turn. For strength, for one attack, character is exposed. The effect is doubled. Gain five block, gain five block next turn. It's like a finishing move. Lots of card draw and big energy for this one. I don't have Elven Ale. Uh, let's fight with him. Were you drunk too? Who would agree to such a thing, Soda? I would, you dick. I was just crazy. I wanted to fight it. three albums. <laughs> Me, you dick. You're just playing this? Nice. It's such a fun game. It's really, really good. I'm enjoying it immensely. Greed. Mm, no. Let's strike again, maybe. Uh, poopy. That was dumb. I'm dumb. Hmm. is this shit? Got him. Uh, no, I haven't played Soya Spire with mods. Never much felt like it. at this point. Ow. He's pretty strong. Buddy might be. Uh, he's not dead yet. He's getting there though. Big money and some stuff. Pawn taking health damage. Gain one strength. Gain one exposed and two armor. Three disarmed or three turns. Gain five HP, two armor, and burn three status cards at the start of the turn. Ooh. Where do I see what my, oops, no, no, hmm, what my character does for the class I chose. I don't think I can. That seems pretty good. I 
don't know. You play Bellatro? Oh, tons of Bellatro. Very, very much working on getting home. I have a full, uh, what is it? Collection. I've my I got everything for the collection, and now I'm working on getting all of the decks with a gold stake one before moving on to the challenges. The DLC they're releasing, and eh, you know, whatever. I don't really, I don't know, I don't really care. It don't really bother me none. Grudge could be good. I'll take Fearlessness. Inflict four weakness on all enemies. Gain two armor. Playing two attacks in a row, gain two strength, gain two balm. Uh, let's take the helmet. Get some armor. Take Mishim Ale. Very nice. Okay. That's a good start. Win a battle in one turn, got an achievement. Pretty good. Drain the juices. Deal six damage, restore ten health. Let's drain the juices. Yeah, I don't really have any thoughts on the DLCs they're releasing. The whole, like, crossover between indie game things is, like, kind of cringe to me. Pretty much no matter how it's done. So it's a little cringy. A little... It takes, it takes a little bit of the, uh, immersion away. But, you know, as long as it's fun, I don't really care. Whatever. I mean, when blocked the bridge over the ravine in barrels of gunpowder, I was sitting on top of them. Apparently, he deemed it necessary to blow up the bridge for some reason. He did not want to wait until I crossed. Talk to him. I want to know why he needed to blow up the bridge. I asked him about it, and he, and it wasted precious time. The fuse burned out, there was an explosion, the bridge collapsed. I had to look for another way. Did you at least find out why it was necessary to blow up the bridge? It's because of the dwarves who are chasing the inhabitants of the heathlands and driving them south towards Sunny City. Humans mine the bridge to stop their pursuers, or at least detain them. Turns out they're unwittingly helping the elves to delay the invasion. No wonder they have a common enemy. They could even unite. The elves were smarter. How quickly things have escalated because of Ingvar's death. Don't be so naive. Ingvar's death was just the trigger. Yeah! Alright, well. I guess nothing happened. Weird. How many games has Dead Cells crossed over with now? 20? Something like that. Yeah, it's pretty wild. It's pretty wild. Mm, four armor is pretty nice. 20? That's crazy. Yep. That's pretty crazy. Yeah, Vampire Survivors with the the Amogus. So lame. Oh. Oh, it's just the chest. There was a dwarf in the chest. As soon as I opened the lid, he jumped out like a jack in the box. Aha, got you. Fess up, spy. Have you come for the letter? Ha uh ha, -huh, for the letter? What letter? Mm. Quit acting. Tell me quickly what this all means. I'd like to know what this all means myself. Don't want to talk? Well, I'll make you. What? Oh my. Uh, health damage, gain one strength. Fury when playing two cards is the same type of no. Gain strength. Oh, Jesus. Pocket Woogie! Holy shit. For another year, Patty Party. Thank you for the 11 year resub. Welcome back. Holy shit, dude. I very much appreciate that. Thanks for being subbed for 11 years. That's wild. Thank you. Bum, 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 bum. 
Boom, 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 boom. I can attack, and then I can do this. And then I can attack. Again. This guy's gonna kick my ass. Uh oh. Uh. Oh, it's a status. So I can do. Skill. Status. Attack. Status. Can't power a gold. Uh. But whatever. Hmm. It's a skill. So let's do attack, stun. He's stunned, so that's fine that he got Fury. Ew. This guy is really beefy. 22, dude. What the hell? It's so ridiculous. Hitting him is only going to make it go up. Shit, dude. This is ridiculous. Gotta fucking hit him. Well, if I lose, <laughs> this guy is ridiculous, man. Like, what am I supposed to do against this shithead? Rar, yeah, fuck off. Holy shit, man. I can live. It's okay. He's only doing 117 twice. Things are not going well. It's hardcore difficulty. Hardcore difficulty. You know, I'm, you're immersed when I, you can only see bald and eyes. Like I'm leaning forward like this. Like, hmm. Get closer to the video game. I'll do better. All the roguelikes you've played, which is the best? Uh, probably... It's hard to choose between Slay the Spire and Enter the Gungeon. I don't know. I don't know what I'd choose between the two. Dead Cells is also up there, but I don't think it's quite on the same level. Hardcore difficulty is a little ridiculous sometimes. Some events are very doable. Some events are like, I don't know how you're supposed to ever do this. It's pretty crazy. And that was just like 
not even it was just like a random event too it wasn't even anything crazy no I've not played FTL and I'm not going to I've watched people play it it looks horrible I don't like games where you can just have a chance to miss when you're attacking but like that is that is like a gaming sin for me it bothers me. Darkest Dungeon does that. FTL does that. Uh, XCOM does that. Anything with like a percent chance to miss just bugs the fuck out of me. I know XCOM is in roguelike, but it's what I immediately think of when I think of percent chance to miss. It bugs me in Fallout too, but Fallout is also a shooter that you can like you can aim down sights and actually aim so it's whatever Stragon Biggie hmm oh, shit man fuck my money better you'd think more people copied their design decisions uh enter the gungeon yeah you would think not a chance hmm. burn gain one energy mm hmm hmm Ooh. meat Into the Breach, I've also seen that. And I don't know. It's hard to get me to play games that uh, aren't more action-oriented. This was a... Uh, a sponsorship to play this game. And it's like Slay the Spire, which I already enjoyed playing. So, otherwise you might not see me... Uh, do this. This kind of game. Refuse! Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. A breather never hurt anybody. Too much money. Weird sound. Damage taken reduced by 50% when taking HP damage gains strength. Ugh. What a dick. I didn't kill him? The reduced damage, man. Fuck. Oh, fuck you, game. You have. 
have one less in flame. Deal five damage upon dealing HP damage gain five gold. Deal nine damage damage exposed. Deal the same damage once again. Let's take that. The roguish lunge. Thing I like about this game is story kind of matters a bit. It does. You actually like pay attention to what all of the events say as well, which in Slay the Spire, you like after you see it twice, you just stop looking at it, and you like you just glaze over, and that's it. Not necessarily a bad thing, just this is different, which is nice. Money. You see Ember Word? No. What's that? What that is? Aw, oh, come on now. Can I do 12 damage this turn? Oh my god. Understandable. Gain one gold for each 20 gold you have. Hmm. Yeah. Need the money. Another boar leg. Wait. I didn't have one yet, did I? I did. I had two boar legs. Allow me to pass. I don't know who you are. Don't come any closer. Okay. Upon death deals damage to everyone on the battlefield. If the owner dies or takes more than 15 damage at a time, add deactivator to the discard pile. It deactivate the counter before the bomb explodes. So I have to kill him, but also not touch. Hey, that's my card. That one won't rise from the dead. Ha ha. Got his ass. Hmm. I'll take four damage. See you, old AI. Thanks for hanging out. Tower of Defense, where you build a maze made of tetrominoes, and you get a random tower and relic, which is the roguelike aspect. Oh, interesting. No, I had not heard of that. Mm. 32 gold, huh? To not take 10 damage. I paid his price. Hmm. Robber's armor. Hmm. It's 
good for gold. When you gain gold during a battle, draw a card. For every three cards played, gain one strength. When visiting a vendor, gain 500 gold and three random potions. At the start of the turn, reset the cost of cards and hand a zero before play. Gain one evasion. Hmm, that is... Burn returns all burned cards to the discard. Oh, that could be bad and good. Five armor and three ward. I'll take this. Five armor and three ward is really good, but... Flint. Restore 20 HP and increase maximum health by 20 upon visiting in camp. Ooh. Damn. Damn. That's pretty dope. I thought there was a camp coming up. I guess not. Hey, it wasn't a it wasn't an idiot. Oh, another robber gear. Jab cards inflict one poison and it adds two jabs. Sure. All right, that's good. That's really good cuz now I'm going to get a lot of cards. Yeah, sure, go ahead. Go ahead, Bommel. I took note of the chest where the flaky dwarf was hiding. Sit on the lid. Sat on the chest lid. The dwarf tried to get out. Small strength was too little for the test. Then he yelled, Aha! Got you! Let me out now! How did you know I'd be here? Who told you? Do you have an accomplice? Tell me everything right now, or I'll skin you alive when I get out of here. Listen, you rascal bastard. You're not going to sit on that lid forever. You better give up. Give up. Got up from the lid and the dwarf jumps out of the chest. That's better. You're my captive, so no nonsense. Lead me to the other chests. Chests? Don't pretend you don't know, spy. The letter says there are other chests with letters in them. I'll find and read them all, and I'll finally figure out what you're up to. Hurry and lead the way. Uh, oh. Well, that's nice. No! Not the lady. There must have been some misunderstanding. I was violently attacked by two elves, a father and son. The boy barely more than a child. It is unlike an elf to risk the life of a child over a surprise encounter with a stranger. More likely, they mistook me for someone else. But what could I do? I had to defend myself. Oh. Uh oh. I don't want to fight the elves, especially children. The only way to avoid it is to go to the east, which is occupied by the dwarves. I'll do it next time. When you're reborn, you can change the route. Good thinking, Percival, that this is the only one of the possibilities you have. What are you talking about? Why do you think they attacked you? Obviously, they mistook me for someone else. For another human, Percival. For a human. The bandits. Right. So that elven lady was killed by the bandits. But what can I do about it? Well, I didn't promise that it would be easy. What bandits? Oh, I have to go down. Oh, that's cool. There's a route with bandits. Here, look. That's so cool. So this is here. Where are the bandits? Is it the dying bandit? It must be the it must be the uh the dying bandit. I guess. Oh, bandit camp. Here we go. So you have to start by going to the bandit camp and then come across to go down here. That's so cool. Interesting. For now, I have to kill a child. It's God of War. <laughs> oh, that's funny. They made God of War. Boy. What's the sign just below and to the right of the yellow one on the map? Uh, I'll have to look in a little while. 
Oh boy. Okay. Uh, oh, he's got taunt. On the count of zero, the battle ends. You better not touch the kid. Oh. Um. Ah! 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 To me? No! Don't be preposterous. So much greed. I hate it. Why is he doing so much damage? Oh, I see. I understand. What do I burned? Oh, they burn. Okay. Dude, what the hell? Just more Zowie. Thanks for the 20 months. Welcome back. Thanks for the reset. Appreciate you. Howdy, howdy. Howdy, howdy, patty spin. Howdy. Welcome back. New alerts. Old. It was an old alert. Ancient, even. That was from nine years ago. I brought it back. Yay! Attack enemy, enemy does more damage. Yeah, it's pretty rough. Like, your actions have a very big outcome on what the enemy decides to do. Hey, Peglin did get 1.0. What's up, Slothbeard? It's a, it's a little bit much. It's a little bit much, I agree. I really don't want to return all burned cards to the discard because I have a lot of status things. I didn't think about that when taking this. Uh, I guess I want to do this. God damn, dude. What the hell? Gain strength. Why? Why? You have so much. What? Skills cannot be played. Wow, dude. Okay. Very cool. That's bad. Our meeting is close. Yeah, it sure is. If I do not kill him, what? Oh, he's not attacking me. Oh. That was so lucky. That was so lucky. Oh my god. Kick his ass, sea bass. Oh. Whew. Holy shit, man. Holy shit. 
Sharp Dagger. Deep Wound. Deal 6 damage if the target is bleeding. Increase bleeding by 6. At the start of the turn, gain either 1 evasion or 4 bleeding. Start of the turn, lose 1 HP per bleeding. Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't know about that. Start of the turn, lose 1 strength and gain 1 agility. Draw one from the draw pile, discard a random card each time a card is burned. I guess I'll take the sharp dagger, but not equip it. Charm. What does the charm do? At the start of the turn, draw one random card from the discard pile. Eh, we'll keep the flint. Ooh, I'm forging. Oh, fuck, I'm forging. Lots of good options here. Many, many good options. Let's do this. Need money. These all kind of suck. Yeah, sometimes you get bad cards. These things happen. Oh, I didn't look at the map. I'm sorry. Your fellows in misery didn't show you sympathy and didn't expect compassion from you. True. use all my energy did he miss me oh yeah I get an evasion don't I I forgot about that Sick. <laughs> that was dumb whoops Oh, it doesn't do damage and like. Oh man, who are you attacking? Hmm. Yeehaw! I wonder what would have happened if you attacked the kid in the previous battle. You can't. Yeah. If you AOE, then that would be very bad, though. I would imagine. Prefer you didn't attack me. Uh, I don't really want to spend 45 gold to make it happen, though, so I guess. be fine that will be fine Money. I like having big scary man on my team Ooh. ah the po oh another robber gear for every three cards played gain one strength probably gonna take that poison blades tempting though Five poison, dude. Master's sword. Hmm. No, we're taking the robber's helmet. Seems wicked, Schmat. 
Restored 20 health, increased by 20. I'm going to use one of these and equip this. I only need one more piece of gear for the robber's set, or two more. Hmm. Getting one more. Should I fry the boar leg? No, I want to upgrade my cards for sure. Um, as I get richer, I will have more greed the in old days. So, oh. I was a fairly frequent guest of the elves. These woods have always welcomed me. No bandits or man eating beasts, and a sea of elven ale. Is all that truly over? Mm-hmm. It's gone forever. The feud between the elves and the humans will only grow, and I see no end to it. Mm -hmm. No, no, there must be a way to fix everything. An age-old friendship can't end like this. If Sigismund is replaced by a more worthy ruler, it's better if we discussed it later. No need to get ahead of ourselves. <laughs> You're talking about this yellow symbol? I did hear about the new Heroes of Might and Magic. New Metsu. I did. I didn't uh, see the announcement, though. I just heard about it. It moved now. What? The thing that's now to the right, above the orange skull. The scout event. Oh yeah, there's all there's all kinds of stuff. And all kinds of different things. Oh, you saw the name flash up. Yeah, there's all kinds of stuff. Mm-hmm. This guy's gonna kick my ass. Champion across the entire frontier, following my footsteps to challenge me to a fair duel. The elves are a fair duel, a bit strange. Considering he had a squire with him, they attacked me both. Strictly speaking, that fight could be called neither fair nor a duel. There was one-on-one -on -one combat, isn't it? Did the squire beat you too? Actually, he didn't. Well, he doesn't count then. Oh boy. Enhances the effect from gaining strength and block. Block does not disappear. Hmm. Hmm. So I got three jabs. So let's do this. Well, okay. A breather never hurt anyone. Jesus. Tempting. Mm. Oh, he's not attacking me, so I don't care. Whoa. Okay. 
Oh, what the heck, man? That's so lame. Ada. Let's take the double blow here. Now I can jab him to do poison. And then hit him for some damage. Hmm. Still not attacking me. At the start of the turn, draw a jab. Ah. Now it makes sense. Sixty-three damage. Coming in hot. Does he go first? Let's see. Sick. Not even close, baby. Because he never attacked me. Pretty dope. Gain one exposed and deal 14 damage two times to all enemies. Start of the turn, gain one strength. Definitely taking ethereal armor. Uh, I don't have an amulet yet, right? I do not. Gain one energy and four evasion. Gain one energy and five armor. Gain one energy at the start of the turn. Gain one strength and lose one agility. Um, I'm going to take the four evasion. That's a lot of evasion. Sick. That's the metal. Start of the battle. Gain ten gold for each battle won. Each one battle upgrades a random card in the deck. Yeah. Yoink. Um, we're gonna start with... Does that make it cost two? Ooh-wee! Do effective guard. Uh, purification. Remove all negative effects and burn all status cards. Yoink. Leaving the frontier, I couldn't get enough of the fresh northern breeze carrying the scents of heaven and pine needles. Goodbye, the northern breeze. Hello, the unbearable stench of the rotten bog. The swamp monsters bothered me much less than the stench. The mosquitoes, leeches, and swamp fever. Ew. Uh, I think I'm supposed to go here. And maybe I can sacrifice the guy there and double up. Doubling up sounds pretty good. Puppies! Okay. Mm -hmm. The means don't matter. Mm -hmm. Sick. Reborn next turn with 50% HP. Good lord, man. What the hell's that about? dust. Bonk. 
What? No, don't do that. Where did all these come from? No. What the fuck? What the fuck? That's so lame. Who's attacking me? You. In the back. You got him. Oh, I got him from hitting the doggies. I see. Hey, Joben de Host. Joben du Host. The coffining's good. I'm enjoying it immensely. Two wound. What is a wound? Oh. Nope. Eight damage, increased damage by four. This combat of character exposed, increased by eight. Burn. Double current strength. Rampage could be good. I'm drawing cards like crazy. I'm gonna take that. Two armor and two strength. Increase maximum health by 10 upon taking health damage, gain five block and two armor. Don't I have, isn't all my stuff that exact? I need like a weapon and a shield. I don't want to get rid of my robber's stuff. Hmm, bummer. The stale power of the swift. The stale, foul air of the swamps was definitely not good for me. I felt weak and started having shortness of breath. I tried to get out of there faster, but it's easier said than done. It's very easy to get lost in the rotten bog. Sooner or later I'd memorize the route, but until it happened, I was forced to walk around in circles and endure the stench, mosquitoes, leeches, and swamp fever. Uh, left. Wait. I want to go south. completely exhausted. I was bitten by some midges. My clothes were drenched in sweat and mud. Heavy lumps of clay stuck to my boots. I caught some disease. I almost drowned a couple times. And this is not a complete list of the adventures that I was lucky enough to survive until I finally reached somewhat solid ground. Suffer. <laughs> I lost f is it 17 maximum health? Jeez. It's messed up. I wandered into the village in the middle of the swamp and saw for myself the people of the rotten bog did not like outsiders. The only person who agreed to talk with me was a local elder. He taught me how to earn the trust of the locals. To achieve that, you had to drink their sacred drink, called Ica of the Might. Agree? The power of the Ica will bring you back to life after Melanus kills you. This gives you a chance to defeat her. I was overjoyed. I was overjoyed I that people actually lived in the swamps. What's up, Barb? I thought we'd find common. Hey, gobblers. But my excitement turned out to be premature. Premature. The inhabitants of the rotten bog gave me the cold shoulder. Soon, their thinly disguised animosity shifted to outright aggression. Oh no. All those people are adherents of the secret cult of the divine might. It has existed for a very long time, but very few know anything about it. Sub to nine. The cultists have done everything in their power to maintain secrecy, including get out of my right ear. Oh, I hate it. Of their rituals. Thank you. Uh, I kind of want to avoid going to the chests, so I'm afraid that my dwarf will leave. I don't want him to leave, so I think I'm going to take the question marks to this. Let's do that. Happened to witness some kind of ritual. Locals call it Might's Bride. A young girl was carried to the swamp and tied to a pole. First she behaved indifferently, but when huge swamp mites crawled out of the water and came closer to her, I noticed fear in her eyes. Uh. 
save the girl. I'm a good boy. A human sacrifice. I wonder if the mites simply ate her or dragged her down to their deity. Decided to interrupt the spectacle and jumped out onto the stage in the role of a hero's savior. That's me. A damsel, you say? In distress? Oh, don't those look lovely. Um, yikes. Just immediately yikes. Uh, bu 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 Yet another murder in the bag. Yet another murder. Mm, I would rather not take this damage, but I also don't want to spend 72 gold. <laughs> oh, I have evasion. I have five evasion, so we're good. Uh-huh. Me again? You bastard. Money. getting strength. Oh, every time I play three cards. Ooh. Okay. Oh, we got an ad coming. I jab, I jab. I lunge, I lunge. I'm insatiable. I guard. Do I power a gold? Why not? I power of gold. I jab again. I guard again. I lunge again. And then I wait. Oh, I can head her. Sick. Gold diggers lunge. Four piercing damage. Bitter tears of the bride. Upon receiving negative effect from an enemy, inflict two miss on them. Once per battle. What is miss? I mean, I guess I can figure it out later. I did headbutt a giant mite. Burn, add four curses to the deck, gain one immune. Burn two random cards, return one burn card of your choice to your hand. Burn. I think I skipped these. Those don't really fit. A dirk? Two strength, one evasion. Ten damage, cost of attacks, and zero before play. Two damage, and inflict eight bleeding. We're taking it. Yes. Uh, another purification, maybe? Sure. Terrible predatory creatures. Right, I'll be back in a few minutes. The swamps. They have no place in our world. Thank you for hanging out. I need to, I need to pee, so I'm going to do it during the ad break. I'll be right back. Bye bye. Stick around. Don't go anywhere. Don't you do it. Ah, successful. These are all products of the so called divine might. Ooh. Might? I feel those creatures emanating a demonic presence, but it's nothing like the demons I fought of old. I know not the nature of this entity. It could have been born out of some primordial spirit's insanity, but it might also be of demonic origin. Why does he got finger guns when he shrugs? Where it dwells or what it looks like is not known. It must be some enormous half-intelligent beast lurking in the murky depths of the bog. The bog? So you say it's hiding? 
I can't say I feel at all like finding it. I kind of do, though. <laughs> hey, man! <laughs> hey, man! You want some uh, pickled nuts, man? Smell this shit, bro. Oh, yeah, that's the good stuff, man. Hey, how about a taste? You want some? Only 40 gold. It's a deal, man, I'm telling you. You go down the street, any other person's gonna be 60, 70 gold easy. Yeah, this is the good stuff. Oh, fuck yeah, man. Hey, try some, won't you? <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's the thing, Emo. You're right. Wandering around the swamps, I came across a dilapidated hut of an alchemist. Its owner, as decrepit as his abode, told me that many years ago he'd moved to the Rotten Bog to be close to his precious ingredients. You have to love your vocation very much to decide to do such a thing. Asked if I could buy some potions from him. Turned out that this man doesn't need money at all, because he simply has nowhere to spend it and nothing to spend it on. However, he agreed to give me his latest invention absolutely free for the triumph of science. Could the old man possibly be out of his mind after living among the precious mosses and lovely lichens? Every minute of conversation, I doubted his sanity more and more. What did I get? Weird potion. The effect is unknown, may be fatal. Never drink this if you have one life only. <sighs> I met a very unusual zombie. To be precise, what was unusual about him was his garb. Heavily gilded armor. It's easy to run away from walking dead man clad in heavy armor. But what if you kill him and take his armor? It would have definitely been useful to me. However, killing a zombie in armor like that would not be easy. Oh, you know I gotta take him on. It's a free card upgrade. <laughs> the temptation was too strong to resist, so I rushed into battle. Hurrah! Alright, what do we got? Being an ordinary zombie. When receiving damage, steals strength from the attacker. Blocks damage taken from attacks less than 5 and gains strength. When losing HP, there's a chance to add a status card to the draw pile. If no HP is lost, gain 1 strength. Holy shit, dude. Fuck off. <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? How am I supposed to fight this motherfucker? What? give him any more strength that this is how I kill him right there that's fine I want that back okay Bye bye. All right, another gold digger's lunge. Cool, cool. Inscribed armor of the Fire Brothers. Flaming item, defiled item. Lose ten health, gain ten armor. The attacker takes half of the blocked damage. 
Ignore damage from burning. Sure, dude. Oh my god. Do these people drink this foul brew to transform into a slobbering zombie on purpose? I guess that doesn't count as a battle because I didn't get a card upgraded. Oh yeah, I did. I did. They drink it to reach unity with their precious deity. Consuming ichor of might for dozens or even hundreds of years slowly turns a person into a shambling, barely intelligent creature. Morning, Despite Jolly Jace. All of this, the Is the cake alive? Zombies as their sure. Ancestors. Yeah. And by the way, hey, Wolf. these ancestors avoid harming their descendants and even protect them to an extent mm. by guarding the rotten body guarding. from uninvited guests. I figured that out for myself. Now let's continue with my story. Yeah. Shut the fuck up. A death idol, ancient and moldy. That death trap was just the right place for it. Should you make an offering to such dangerous and inconceivable forces? Sacrifice your ally. Bye-bye. <clears throat> the sacrifice was not in vain. Hell yeah, dude. So now I have... That idol I came across in the swamps was truly sinister and unusual. Did the cult place it there? You're mistaken. As the cultists of the Might do not honor any idols, their beliefs are of a different kind. You happened across an idol of death. They appear in wild and uninhabited areas. I don't know who places them. The worship of death is obviously a secret affair, so no one will admit of it to you. Instead of an offering of gold, it demanded my blood. Mm -hmm. That's right. By bringing your death closer, you earn its favor. Mm. So, do I have two revives now? Because if that's the case, I kind of want to. I kind of want to drink that potion. <laughs> Unpleasant incident. Picked up a mite somewhere in the forest. Had to go through some trouble with it. Pulling out a mite with a thread is a good way, but takes too much time. Twain. Clink, clink, clink. Uh, three piercing damage three times. Hmm, not burning this for more agility seems pretty good. Let's do that. Get rid of the burn, play it more often. Very strong. I don't know that I've done this boss. Oh, yeah, yeah. So you would let anyone out of the swamps. Blah, blah, blah. Start battle. He holds the real Prevent the next death. Fully restore health after that. Gain three insubstantiability until the end of the game. Any HP recovery after that is impossible. Well, which one goes first? One is good and one is not. Upon death reborn... Block does not disappear at the start of turn. At the end of the turn, take damage for each abscess in hand. Mm -hmm. Pretty solid turn. A breather never hurt anybody. I don't think it saved him. Don't add two abscesses to my hand, you bastard. Oh! Goodbye. Can't be discarded. Burn. If it remains in hand, gain four burning. Efficiency grows. Um. 
Ha ha. Got him. This infection again, dude. Return all burned cards. I don't want to return all burned cards. And I don't want a hand of just lunges. Or jabs, rather. Nah. We ain't doing that. Uh oh. Oh, I goofed up. Oh well. Ooh. I did do one damage. It's weird. Don't like this. And yeah, turn take two damage, gain one blight. No. I shan't. I shouldn't have played that yet. Oops. All good. Mm -hmm. Give me my money. Mm. I'm doing okay. Hold off on it. That was pretty good. Whoa. Oh! Oh, he took damage because of the poison! <laughs> so it immediately stunned him. That's so stupid. I love that. Oh, uh, that's really dumb. damage right now. Hello, Ms. Cutscene. How are you this morning? Looks like something you'd see in Dredge. Yeah, it kind of does. Losing HP is a chance to add a status card to the drop pile. No HP is lost. Gain one strength. Block damage taken from attacks less than nine and gain strength. Bully. favorite things to be happening. I'm sorry, what? Why didn't I draw the thing that I just headbutted? Top of the draw pile. What? That's... That's odd. Okay. I no point in spending my gold. He's only got 53 health left. Huh. Well, ain't that a load of shit. Hmm. Debate, debate. Hey, hey. Fool. Bonk. 
Kill the Cult Keeper before he resurrects. Apparently, I killed him before he resurrected. I got a Steam achievement for killing him before he resurrected. I don't know how that works, but very cool. Okay. Burn, deal three damage, gain a copy in the draw. Gain a copy in the draw pile, draw one card. Oh, that's pretty dope. Fluted Axe. When dealing damage, additionally inflict one bleeding. Ethereal burn, double the enemy's bleeding. Oh, shit. Immune for the first four turns. Block cannot be gained. Five agility. What? What is mine? I don't even think I want... I mean, the fluted axe is pretty good. Compared to... Yeah, backstab and cutting veins is not really... I'll take that. It's pretty dope. Grimoire of the Might. At the start of the turn, restore 10 HP and burn all status cards in the draw pile. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Those aren't actually there. That like constantly gets rid of my greed and just that's crazy good. Metal's been really good so far, but that's crazy good. I'm gonna take it. I'm taking it. Deal five damage, gain a copy of drop pile, draw two cards. Header costs zero. What's the other kind of lunge? Oh, it's only gold digger. There's no adaptiveness to it. How is it adaptive if I only have one choice? That's odd. It's not showing me the other... That's so weird. I think that might be a bug. Mouse 2 only shows one path for some reason. That's so weird. Okay. Maybe Dusty Sacks the play? Ah, so I can look at them before I choose. Nimble Lunge, draw four, or draw one, deal two damage. Flourishing, deal four damage, two times damage from lunges is increased. So I could do the increased damage from lunges thing, but... Hmm. Let's do another effective guard. Not so long ago, the Northern Gate was a wonderful place to live, maybe even the best in the whole empire, and Ingvar's rule of the lands flourished, but Sigismund destroyed everything in a wink. It's always easier to break than to build. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where do I want to go? This guy is a prick. I don't know if I want to deal with him. I might go lower route. Swing by the shop. Shop would be very useful for me, I think. Never did... 
Tell me what miss does. Shows token. But it doesn't say what miss is. But it doesn't... Oh, it doesn't even give me energy. Not worth it. Uh, let's unequip this. We got a heal. We got immune. Let's grab that. I got some stuff I want to sell, I think. I might find uh, another piece of robber gear. Seems wicked smart. Let's do that. Drink the weird frat boy potion? Not yet. <laughs> Look at this guy. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, the animations are super cool. The, the event stuff. It's really neat. Let's attack the abomination. I'll be a good boy. Oh, I got the homies. That's a big scary lad. Holy shit. What? That was weird. Okay, what happens here? The end of the turn deals damage, gains strength. 14 armor, 15 balm, 2 strength. Oi. You didn't fight fair. That's good. That's good. Uh, let's header. The gold diggers lunge. The power of gold. Why is this here? That's annoying. Hmm. Alright. How come that didn't burn? Is that a curse? Oh, it's a curse. Curse. It's not a status card. It's a curse. Mm, this is a curse as well. That's unfortunate. Mm. Kind of hoping it would do the infection. I'm kind of very strong. Like, very strong. Holy shit, man. Burn, draw, random attack card costs zero for this turn. That's pretty cute. Love the knockers on this guy. What's up, Spike? Right back at you, big boy. Good to see you. I have a nice build there. I do. I also have two revives. <laughs> oh, man. Um... Sure, I'll take that. The Lance, uh, Piercing Strikes. At the start of the turn, draw two jabs. I kind of like the bleed, though. Knife is great for cutting not only pockets, purses, also their owners. Deal 15 damage, gain 20 bolt gold. Uh, eh, 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 eh. Mm, the Lance, huh?
I do like the bleeding. It's pretty good. Take the thief's knife. Take an elven ale since we don't have any and maybe that'll be good. I was helping kill the possessed man. A fire brothers drove all the villagers into town hall and set it on fire. Only flame can cleanse these people in this land, the commander of the brothers told me. And you, my friend, deserve a reward. Such are the methods of the fire brothers. If they win, the northern gate will turn to ashes. However, you can't defeat the inquilines without their help. It's an interesting situation. Well, that's... that's pleasant. Flash walk with your dogs, got home, then Bagel went, wait, I forgot to poop. <laughs> Silly Bagel. I'm gonna go ahead and move past the uh, horrendous screams of the uh, the damned. Just getting all kinds of stuff here. Oh my god. I have two inscribed things now. Alright, shopkeep. What you got? I can remove cards. That's big. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Damn, that's worth a hundred and twenty? That is pretty wild, but I don't want it. Don't need that. Don't need this. What is this? Tiredness. Get rid of that. I think I go ahead and get rid of all this fire bros shit. What do you have? Oh, this looks interesting. Increase maximum health by 20. Upon dealing damage, gain one armor and one exposed. Yikes. Gain two strength. Inflict three weakness? Holy shit. The start of the turn, only half of block is removed. Oh. Oh, oh, that seems good. I don't think there's any uh, thieves stuff, sadly. I don't even know what the thief stuff would look like. Sting. Hmm. Boots of the Fire Brothers. Oh, another shield. No block at the end of the turn, gain 10 block. A robber's buckler, yo! There it is. When losing gold, gain one block for each lost coin. Yoink. It's a bummer that I'm not going to be able to actually utilize the effect that it gives me, but I'm just missing the... Sadly, the thieves' knife is not the robber's weapon. That is a bummer. I definitely would like to remove the... I cannot remove the curses because I think they came with whatever I've done to get cursed. I see. I think I want to get rid of... Where is it? Why can't I get rid of, like, half the cards I have in my deck? What the hell?
If at the beginning of the turn you have more money than block, block does not disappear. What the fuck? That's crazy. Yeah, why can't I get rid of effortless motion? I don't want this. But I guess that's the effect of something... Maybe one of my... Ah, uh, because it's attached to the, the armor. I see now. I understand. All right, I think I'm good. Well, I could remove a card anyways. Let's see if there's anything I want to remove. Not especially. No, I think I'm good. The evil seed of what I've done, I know. All right, that was, uh, that was pretty nice. That was pretty nice. A throng of peasants have gathered on the outskirts of a village. After edging my way through a crowd, I saw an inquiline who was telling the people about a new way of living. He called it inquilinism. I'm about to call you dead. Hey, stop, what a bash. Negate the next debuff. Oh, all right. Hmm. I appear to do a lot of stuff. Sure. Ouch. What is this? Randomize the cost of one to three of all cards in the hand. Bleh. Gross. Small amount of block. Yeah, a little bit. Just me. Just a little bit. Let's do that. And that. And that. And that. Oh, all done. What the fuck is that? Gift of Abundance. As the start of turn, draw one extra if no card in hand was played. Remove if all cards were played. Uh, okay. I have status cards. I appear to have status cards. Holy shit. Holy shit. <laughs> I had so many. What is this? Vessel of Deception appear on the battlefield. It takes away all unplayed cards. If destroyed, the cards are returned to the draw pile. Receives a maximum of one damage. <laughs> Quit. Money. Okay. Where did this one come from? All receive damage reduced to one. Okay. I'm just gonna. When does this end? This sucks. Power of gold actually is zero this time. That's good. Um. Ew. I don't really want any of this. 
I don't really care about any of this either. 36 damage, 18 damage. Biforked Tail. Gain 5 agility. At the start of the turn, enemies gain 50 block. At the end of the turn, gain 30 block. Hell no. Mm -mm. Hell no. More effective guards, please. The chest. Doesn't really matter. I wasn't hoping for much, but still I visited the palace armory just in case, and I was very surprised by what I saw. I thought that everything had been pillaged, but it turned out that the equipment was emblazed and well guarded. The head of the guard turned out to be an old friend of mine, a guardsman. We didn't ask each other awkward, unnecessary questions. Nothing personal, just business. Ask for equipment, 200 coins. Well, let's see what happens. Money down, equipment up. This shit sucks. Can he get some specific equipment? No, I asked about it and he answered quite harshly that it wasn't a store. Well, that makes sense. Ah, right, well that event sucks. Hey, Milius. Has there been an intermittence during transmission? Oh, yeah. My stream went down. Could fry the boar leg. Might not be a horrible thing to do. Restore health fully. Alright, let's look at equipment before going in. Um, I want to equip this. Seems good. Because I have I have three lives. <laughs> Reminisced about my friendship with Sigismund, our childhood youth, and Ingvar. Even though they are brothers, Ingvar's status as the heir distanced him from us with each passing year and brought Sigismund and me ever closer. In a way, it made the two of us equal. The son of a lord and the son of a poor man. Who would have thought that it would all turn out this way? Me, I did. I'm tempted to have the potion now. I got salt in the wound immediately? That sucks. What the hell? Wallet strike now. Sure. Why not? A breather never hurt anybody. Hmm. Hmm. 
Hey, Pega. Shift ending soon, as soon as this runs over, I think so. Let's see. Pretty strong lad. And a spooky. Hmm. Betting on strength is justified. What is this? 50% less damage. That's annoying. See what happens. Oh, he doesn't do anything? Interesting. I thought he would like, uh... I'm very strong. Holy shit, I'm very strong. Hmm. I'll wait. That's fine. Never stops attacking. I never stop stopping. That's right. Money. Fun. Really tempted for weird potion. Really tempted. all gold the demon skips a turn nope 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 I need it. Don't question me. Mm -hmm. Ah, unfortunate. I thought those would be your last words. Oh my. Oh god. Oh Jesus. High chance of the hero taking two strength from the demon. Low chance the demon taking two strength from the hero. Hero takes five strength from the demon or the reverse. High chance of the demon taking ten strength from the hero. 
Dude, I don't need strength. I don't care about any of this. Just small bet. I don't care. It don't matter none. Mm. Hmm. Replace selected card in hand with a cloned card of your choice from the draw pile. Well, that's... That's great. <laughs> really good stuff. Of damage, sir. Oh boy. Um. Hmm. The fuck? Oh, it gave me money, so I drew a card. Hmm. Replace selected card in hand with a cloned card of your choice from the draw pile. Card in hand. 50% less damage. Holy shit, dude. Beginning of your turn, you have more money than block. Block does not disappear. Gain extra 50 gold per battle. Stats of all strike gold and shield, depending on your gold amount. Gain extra turn and special demonic cards. Upon playing demonic cards, the turn ends. Why does he have so much... I'm gonna die. <laughs> I don't like that. Why does he have that? think I die here, do I? Oh, I have I have evasion still. I'm good. I'm fucking chilling, dude. I am big chilling. What's in the black box? Uh sure. Ooh. Ooh, very nice. Very nice. Oh, I think I'll uh, go ahead and end the the thing here. Defeat the source of greed embodied in Sigismund. And then, later on, I just waited for you. GG. No need for a weird potion. I, I want to see what it does. I knew you'd show up. Rather, I had no idea what to do next. I guess I didn't even care. So this is the end of the story. Or maybe not. Oh, God. I hate killing this fool. I hope I won't have to anymore. He's caused a lot of trouble, and we need to do our best if we want to fix everything. The elves won't hold what? the frontier. It'll be seized before we can intervene. We'll have to use force to put an end to the arrogance of the overreaching dwarves. You've managed to undermine the basis of the Grim Cult's survival. The Fire Brothers will easily complete what you have begun, and there will be nothing left of the Rotten Bog. Dope. When you killed Sigismund, 
You saved the Fire Brotherhood, and they won't forget it. You will unite the people disgruntled with the rule of the Inquilines with the Fire Army. And together, you'll put an end to the demon domination. That's, this all seems pretty good. Are you ready to face Melenis again? Sooner or later, you'll kill her. And then no one will stand in our way. Ew. Want to know how I got these scars? The path which Mortis is taking you on will lead to the fulfillment of his plans, and you will remain a pawn in his game. Alright, that's fine. Melissa is overconfident, make her nervous, destroy her immunity. HP is not lost, Melissa steals 100% more damage. HP is not lost, Melissa is immune to any effects. HP is not lost, playing three cards of the same type in a row burns a random card in hand. Oh shit, dude. No, uh, Mortis is my friend. Place a jab with what do I want another one of? You get another thing. Another one of these might not be terrible. Another wallet strike. Another chaos could be good. Hmm. Yeah, I have one big eye. Yeah. Yes, indeed. New emote. Tempted to do salt in the wound, but I'm not going to do any bleed damage for like how many turns I'm gonna draw it and then it's gonna disappear but I guess I can use effortless motion to get it back so let's try it I guess I'm gaining strength, technically. That was a skill. Let's do an attack, skill. So you slipped away from death. What are you doing next? Uh. Uh. Mark of absolute superiority. What? Uh. 
all positive effects. That would suck. I guess... Sacrifice of flesh? Self-confidence. Higher knowledge is HP is not lost. I don't... All of them are HP is not lost. So what the fuck do I do? What the fuck do I do? Oh. 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 Holy shit. Okay, now I have stuff to do. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, it adds going? I guess I'll, I'll be back in a few minutes. BRB. Now it's a party. Oi. Ooh. Okay. In the turn, doubles block. Beware of exploding spikes. Ignore all non-targeted attacks and skills. Thank you. Huh. What is this? Oh, okay. Not spending enough energy. Fuck. That's. Now it's irrelevant. Shit. That's pretty good. Okay. Card. I definitely don't want to do the remove positive effects until the last time, I think. I don't know. Morning, go to bed. Nope. We gotta finish the run. Hello, backup.
Ooh, I have a lot more block. And money now. That's not good. Yep, now it's gone. <laughs> that sucks. Okay, understandable. Have a nice day. Stop that, lady. You stop that. Oh, jam. Gold digger lunge. Guard. Header. Gold digger lunge. Let's see. Stability. Gold. Uh, rampage. Gold digger lunge. Guard. Ouch, oof. Remove the mark secret magic reduces number of cards drawn at the beginning of one turn by two. Getting more money and upping my strength, even though it won't matter. Turns into a snake. Oh, well, that's nice. Um, another rampage seems pretty good. Wait, why does it say eight damage? Hmm. Let's get rid of the jab and take another rampage. Ew. All right. I don't I don't know. I guess I have to get rid of her block. Sure. Oh, wait. Oh, I don't have to worry about the three cards in a row thing anymore. Oh, that's so good. Stop. Stop it. Oh, I'm confused. Uh oh. Well, that's no good. That's a lot. Come on. 
Ouais. Alright. My buffs! Uh, oh, it doesn't get rid of my skill, though. Yo! What's happening? It seems you're about to die. What? Oh. Nuh uh. What? Fifteen turns. Oh my gosh. Ah! Did I get this back? I got Death's Protection back again. What the fuck? Oh, it's a new... Shit. No barricade. It'll come back. Mm. One times two. Oh no. the burn pot? What the hell? Is this the burn pot? No. Oh, all the burn cards are back. Ah, uh, right, 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 Probably just money, right? Sure. <laughs> Legend. Burn. Deals 306 damage. Oh, that seems pretty cool. Yeah, now we're talking. Yes. This is sick. Jab. Hmm. What? Attacks cannot be played. Hmm. Let's replace hesitate with a cleansing. Hmm. Cool. going on there. Bleh, 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 bleh. Health. Oh my god. It's gonna take a million years. Gains barb. Ooh. That's no good. Hmm? 
What is it that makes me gain strength? By every three cards played, gain one strength. Okay, yeah, cool. Sick. Love it. just got so much block from that. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh! Ouchies. I don't like that. Bleed. Burning. Oh. That's really bad. I don't have a way to heal. I mean, I do, but I also have two revives. I think I'm good. I think I'm gonna be okay. Oh, I don't like that. I do only have nine turns to kill her. I am getting stronger. Da! Am I healing? Oh, I heal every turn, don't I? What heals me? Something heals me. Ah, Grimoire of Might. Oh, okay, so that completely negates it. Sick. What happens when the turn timer is set to zero? Probably ends. I think it's more than death. It's probably you're done now sort of thing. is gonna go away now. I could be bad. Now I'm doing half damage for three turns. Are you kidding me? Damn. What the hell, lady? Oh, I don't have any block for the barb. Oh boy. Um. I have an idea. It involves being an idiot. It's so much money, you know. But I gotta do it, because I need to play cards. I'm glad that didn't uh, ruin my life. That could have been very bad. I still want to know what this potion does. 
I still have two revives too, so if I'm gonna win on the last turn, I'm gonna drink it. I wanna know what it does. Turn. More barb, huh? I don't like that. should drink it. What did it do? I, I don't know. Gave me some cards. Got like five cards. Well, that was less exciting. Bye-bye. Someone who can't see the consequences of his own deeds need free will. GG. Percival fulfilled his purpose without knowing almost anything about it. Oh. He'll make a fine king who will establish balance, order, and peace. I would leave things as they are. If I could. GG. Did it. That was fun. Hardcore greed man. If the weak wolf comes with you until the end of the journey and survives the final battle, he'll become stronger than the pack leader. The cart driver had survived the Lycan's attack. His destiny may, might have played out in a very interesting way, but history doesn't speak in conditional tense. This game's dope. Excited to pick it up yourself? You should. Witches shouldn't have boiled the fire brother in their cauldron. They could have become his friends. charge silhouette that's the demonic gatekeeper but who is the second one the attempt to get on the trail of the murderer might have cost the elven patrol their lives but luckily for them they didn't figure out who had killed the elven messenger Hey, man. Remember me, bro? Man, I'm telling you, you should have some of this shit, man. Something unexplainable is taking place at the old cemetery in the Northern Gate. We won't solve this mystery without your help. The fate of the wounded bandit is somehow connected to the cursed sword, but I fail to make the connection. How? Ah.
I just realized that they are saying knock, knock, knock on the coffin lid. Good morning, Patty. Uh, Rose Red, thank you very much for the 20 months. Good morning. Knock on the coffin lid, knock, knock. Knock on the coffin lid, knock, knock. Knock on the coffin lid, knock. The giant mosquitoes couldn't kill the fishermen who were revived by the power of the ichor and went home. Oh, were they pocket wookie? Oh, shit. That goblin could have been saved, but what for? It's going to jump off the cliff anyway. But what for? Man, there are so many different things you can do. Cody for bruh. It's good the idea of preparing growth elixir from Batu's fat didn't dawn on you and the goblins. It could have ended badly. What you staring at? What are these little mysteries? Just uh, different things that can happen in different events depending on the order and the choices you make. Court Mage dreams of creating a staff of all seeing, but he can't obtain the eye of golden buffalo without your help. See, you have to go kill the golden buffalo or get the eye somehow. Um. And I want to get, I wonder if I can get the core of a golem or whatever. Message of the demons who's soliciting a fil filthy oath is merely a servant to small fish. Hand of fate? No. It's foolish to hope that the peacemaker troll can reconcile an elf and a dwarf without your help. Yeah, there's there's a lot of different ways. Another girl died because of some cruel weird ritual. One shudders to think what an unspeakable horror is waiting for her at the bottom of the swamp. But I saved her. Mortis and Percival are the same person. Yep. That's great. Found out why the cultists allow elven pilgrims to enter the rotten bog. The pilgrims keep the cult's secrets as the Tree of Life is essentially held hostage by the Might Cult. Oh. If Batu were smarter, he would have ordered his goblins to steal the treasury of the underground town. That idea will never come into his useless head. Who the hell is this guy? Yeah, you're supposed to watch the Mites Bride drowning, I guess so. If you offer a cannibal something tastier than his favorite human meat, will he stop being a cannibal? The owner of the cursed sword has amassed a fortune, but I can't trace the future of those treasures or their owner. Ooh, who's that? Hubba hubba. Meanwhile, in the frontier, events that could affect the future of all Midian are happening in a most ordinary tavern.
Okay. Was that person's name for the Chinese man gay? Cool. Mental support team. I see terrible consequences, but I see no reasons for them. It scares me. Very long cat. What would happen if you made Grum's dream come true and made him indistinguishable from Gorbagon? Only the scout can defeat the elven messenger's assassin, but he won't do it because he doesn't know who the assassin is. We have something in common. Interesting, Amelius. Death Servant wants to use blood magic. I wonder what would come out of this. To learn that, you need to take part in the Servant's ritual. We're still going, dude. Oh my god. Uh, Free me. Demonic Blacksmith is the only demon whom even the Brothers of Fire wouldn't kill because he can be confined in the smithy to forge equipment for the Brotherhood, multiplying their might. Oh, it's the potion seller. That guy's an asshole. Traveling merchant is thinking of staying in the Northern Gate, but he definitely won't like it here. Potion seller. These tips for events in the game, yes. Demonic idols have the most noxious impact on children. That's the main danger of these idols. Link. Are these like Kickstarters? You can burn the old abandoned tavern. Its owner won't like that, but who is he? You ain't seen ten bands in your life, shit. Thanks, Bob. Appreciate you. The fact that we held captive by the elves is not as simple as the he seems. The power of money the wins eventually. Short by the most intriguing moment. Power of money wins eventually. So true. So true. Is this the dude in, at the armory? You will put the storekeeper behind bars for selling government equipment. I advise you to do this as soon as possible because the court blacksmith will be burned by the Brothers of Fire and the guard may be left without equipment. You ain't seen ten bands in your life, shit. The fat orc is in Batu's clan? No way, that can't be. Dude... This is ridiculous. They expect you to play this like dozens of times. I think this is like my sixth run and I've played this game for like 30 hours already. This shit takes forever. Squad of Fire Brothers raiding villages in the vicinity of the castle will greatly reduce the number of your subjects. This is the price you will pay for the Brotherhood's loyalty. Yeah, I already did that. Oh! GG? Oh my gosh. Oh. Come on. Ethereal deal 15 damage. If remains in hand at the end of the turn, lose 50 gold. Remove all negative effects, lose 100 gold. 
Damn. Oh, it turns the coffin gold when you do it. That's sick. That's so cool. Nice. Okay, I'm I I'm gonna go. I need to go. I'm hurting. I'm hurting. Card called the power of money. What a fun game. I really enjoy it. Oh, they just pushed an update while I was playing. Interesting. Yeah, alrighty. I still need to play as the other characters. I haven't done it yet. Uh, let's do a little raid ski. A little raiderino. A little, little, little raideroo. 